Hello there, it's Owen Cannon here. Today I'm going to be doing a TV review of Ryan Murphy's Ratchet, which is available on Netflix from Friday, September 18th. For those of you not familiar with the character of Mildred Ratched, her first appearance was in Ken Kesey's 1962 novel One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, which focused on a group of patients living in a psychiatric hospital and featured the cold-hearted manipulative nurse. The character also appeared in Milos Forman's movie of the same name, with the role of Ratched being played by actress Louise Fletcher. This time around, however, we're getting an origin story of the character, with Sarah Paulson playing the title role. We had a saying in the Corps, save one life and you're a hero. Save a hundred lives, well then you're a nurse. When we first meet her, she's attempting to get a job in a hospital. And the series has that trademark Ryan Murphy charm. There's a certain air of mystery about the series, but you would expect nothing else from the creator of the American Horror Story franchise. You should bathe more often. Your fingernails are filthy. The storyline of Ratchet starts out strong, but it gradually fizzles out towards the end of the series, and with only 8 episodes on offer here, it's a little disappointing. The main storyline of the series gets wrapped up pretty much halfway through, with the final few episodes feeling a bit thrown together in an attempt to set up the inevitable second season. What does keep you entertained and enthralled throughout Ratchet, however, is the brilliantly cast supporting characters. Judy Davis as nurse Betsy Bucket is the perfect amount of comedy and sassiness rolled into one. Sophie Okunido as Charlotte Wells steals every scene she is in, while Sharon Stone plays an opulent Lenore Osgood, who is just as iconic as you would imagine. But a great cast cannot save a series that loses its footing along the way, so we've awarded Ratchet 3 out of 5 stars. Let us know what you thought of the series in the comments below and be sure to check out all of our other mini reviews which are available on YouTube.